it feels good to be six and zero now. Um, that's you know our second race today was quite tight. Uh, Synergy got an inside overlap with the bottom mark, and uh, we managed to uh, get them to tack away and uh, uh, incur a penalty. So. Uh, out of that, we got the starboard advantage and got back at them and got ahead on the on the last beat and then um, you know ended up winning the race. So uh, it was a good race for us. It was touch and go. Um, you know, uh, we really worked hard at getting our height and um, you know we got to them just about at the lay line and um, they had to you know uh, bail out. And then we were able to roll them basically and uh, they had to do two tacks at the top mark so uh, I think we played that right and um, you know it was it was real close so it could have gone either way. We uh, or I called a, a bad ley line, um, put the crew into a difficult position, and we're what we call like a no man's land where it's hard to know whether you do one jibe or you take down on one side and then you know jibe and go to the mark. And we were just right in between those um, you know decision point, and it made it real hard on the crew and you know what to do. So. Um, we ended up losing a lot, having to drop the spinnaker early. They carried their spinnaker in, got the inside overlap, and um, rounded the mark ahead of us. You know, uh, we left. Um, they, they kept clear, but then they stayed there. We left again, and they were still there. So I think the umpire saw it that they should, probably should have tacked. And um, we got a penalty. They did tack away. They had a bad tack. We kind of rumbled out to the right, tacked, and we had a we were in a pretty strong position after that. I think so. I think if we would have gone out and won that second race today, um, you know, we'd probably come out flat tomorrow. So, um, kind of behind the scenes, I think it was, it was good to have a tough race like that, make some mistakes. It's going to keep us tough for tomorrow. Let's work at the handles, boys.